Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of this video, we're doing a haul today. So I have 10 items and like all, it's kind of all over the place, lots of different stuff. So I'm just gonna jump right in so this video isn't too long. A lot of this stuff has come from like social media. I'm not gonna lie. I can't be the only one, right? Who like buy stuff because of social media. So I'm trying to figure out where I want to jump in. It's like literally all over the place. I think I'm gonna start with Teresa. So yes, Teresa Caruso. She is, I believe just on Instagram. I don't think she has a YouTube channel, but I follow her on Instagram and I will put it somewhere on the screen. But oh my gosh, if you guys do not follow her, I mean, one, you should, but just beware, you will get sucked in. Her Instagram is so aesthetically pleasing. I can just sit there and scroll forever. And I'm just like, wow, it's all about like organization, how to make laundry better or how to make your kitchen area better or your coffee station. It's just so pretty and everything just looks so nice and she links everything for you. So I have bought a couple of things. Um, the first are clips. <laughs> So this is, like I said, this is all gonna be all over the place. These are, it's one pack. Oh, and I will try to link everything below. But yeah, I bought two of these just because these colors are so pretty. So these clips are plastic, which you can see here, which I really like. And the reason is because I will clip up my hair when I'm in the shower sometimes if I'm not washing my hair and I'm just taking like a body shower. I wanna be able to get them wet. So they're just these neutral colors, like this chocolate brown, this really pretty, a uh, tan nude shade. This is kind of like an ivory and then like a black. So really, really pretty. And I bought two just in case one broke. Love these. So I saw those on her channel. And then the other thing I saw, and I believe this is by Paula's Choice. And I'll show you what I usually use. So this, these are the uh, premium cotton rounds. So I will use these, I mean, for lots of different things, but mainly, to take off makeup, you can just put like a makeup remover and wipe it off. But obviously this is not great for the environment and you have to keep on buying them. So I saw these, does it say? Yeah, so it's Paula's Choice Skincare and it comes in this little like net um, little bag here. And they are, re whoops, they are reusable cotton rounds. So you get all these reusable cotton rounds. I'm sorry, it's bright. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see that or not but it's basically a little cotton round and you can use both sides and then you can just wash them and reuse them. So I loved that idea. I had to pick up some of those. Sticking with influencers, we're gonna move on to the next one, which she has gotten me to purchase a lot of things. She always has so many good products that she talks about. We are talking about Shea Whitney. So first things first, this um, like sweater thing. So it's a, it's a long sleeve sweater. It has a little cuff sleeves and then it has a little puffers here at the shoulder. Love this. So she got this from Amazon and this is actually an Amazon clothing. So it's by Amazon. I went ahead and saved the tag just so I could show you guys. And what's cool about this and I, let me just pull it up on my phone so I can read it. So this item has their climate pledge friendly and what it says so if you log on to the and again i'll link it below so you can log on here and see the sweater and then you can kind of scroll and it'll tell you basically what that means so it says about this item i'm gonna try not to butcher it but it says made with a tensile lyocell blend and hig index materials certified but basically it's made from renewable wood sourced from certified sustainable forests and produced using a closed loop innovative process that saves water, energy, and chemicals. So basically this climate pledge friendly is focusing on like clothing with uh, sustainability in mind. So they wanna you know res use recycled materials or just stuff that helps the planet, which I think is so cool. I mean, you're gonna buy clothes anyways, but if you can help the planet while you're at it, it's a double win. And put aside the fact that the materials came from sustainable resources, one thing that really got me to kind of like jump on this was how she described the feeling of it. She was basically saying how it is so soft, so comfortable. It's one of the softest fabrics. I think she said that she had ever felt. She's not lying. It feels so good. Like the inside and the outside 
it's like warm, but not like too warm. And I live in a hot climate, so I don't want anything that's like super, super heavy, but this is like perfect. I love this. I love the color. I feel like it's a nice, comfortable sweatshirt, but the added little puffer here just makes you feel like so girly and like still chic. So highly recommend this. Okay, so this next product was also inspired by Shay. I think she talked about this towards the end of 2021 in one of her videos. I think it was a gift guide video, but this is the Nod Pod, the weighted blanket for your eyes. And I was immediately intrigued by this item. And the reason is because every single month when I'm about to start my period, I always get these like headaches. They're like mild headaches, but they're, they last like 24 hours, 24 to 36 hours to be honest. And usually what I'll end up doing towards the end of the night, especially if I've been looking at screens all day, is I'll usually close out all the lights and then I'll just like put my hand on my head and sometimes I'll just rub my head and just the pressure of having something over my forehead really helps. And so that's what this is. It's a weighted blanket. You're supposed to put it over your eyes. So I'll show you guys. This is how it comes. Uh, I got this from Nordstrom. And it comes in this little container here. It's like plastic container Oops. and then you get this little pamphlet you don't want to throw this out because there's good information in here it's so cute it says before we sleep together so you open it up like this and it tells you a bunch of good information it tells you how to secure it because there's different ways so and it's like that do you guys hear that it has like all those little beans, uh, those little tiny beads in there. And so you can just like lay it on your head, like on your pillow, just lay it flat. Or you can like loop it through. There's a little hole right there. And so you can loop it through. So it talks about that. And on the other side, it talks about how to care for it. So it says, before you use me, wash me, and then let me air dry. One side is made of cooling Jersey cotton which has to be this side. Yeah, so this is like a cooling Jersey cotton. And then the other side is made of a warm micro fleece. So depending on if it's summer, if it's winter, you know, if you uh, tend to get hot when you sleep or you know, if you want something more cooling, so you're not supposed to put it in the microwave, but you can put it in the freezer. So this is just a cute little like pamphlet that you wanna keep. Now, just being 100% honest, I have not used it yet. And that is because I keep forgetting to wash it because it does say wash it before you use it but I need to use it because this just feels like perfect. And then you can just like lay down and I don't want to put it on my face because I'm wearing makeup. <laughs> but I just think this is so awesome and I'm glad I got it. I just need to remember to use it. <laughs> okay, switching gears to makeup for a second. Whenever I am done doing my makeup, I will always finish off with a makeup setting spray. This is my favorite. It's by Urban Decay. It's their all nighter spray. And I use a lot, like a lot. So then I have this like little cardboard here and I've had this for years. And I usually just like fan myself just to help the setting spray dry. Well, Jacqueline, Jacqueline Hill talked about this. I don't think I've talked about this on my channel yet. Hopefully not, but I love this. So I'm just in case I'm including it in this video. <laughs> but Jacqueline talked about this little fan. So it has a stand and it has a little fan and it's actually um, from the brand Nimia, which is by Nikki Tutorials. And so Jacqueline was basically saying how she originally wanted to create a fan for her brand, but then Nikki came out with this one and she's like, this one's so perfect. So like, this is all I'll ever need. And she's right, this is perfect. This little tiny fan. So like I said, it comes with a stand, super simple. It, um, it comes with the little instructions here. It tells you like how to maintain it, the charging time, all of that. And it also has a little like a uh, USB, uh, plug in and it does give you the cord it's sitting over there sorry but you just like plug it in and you can recharge it it has three settings so I'll show you guys that's the first setting and the first setting is actually pretty strong that's the second setting and that's the third setting it feels so so good so yeah this has definitely replaced my little cardboard don't use that anymore. I just use this. And honestly, I kind of want a second one because I feel like this is perfect. Look how small this is. This is my hand. Look, I'll hold it. 
that's how like tiny it is so it's super super compact and i feel like this would be perfect just to like throw in your bag and you can just like fan yourself if you get hot i mean i don't know i love this i highly recommend it if you wear makeup even if you don't wear makeup this is just a really really good buy okay so i have one more makeup item and then the rest is like household slash everyday practical items so all right lipstick this is by fenty these are her new lipsticks so these are like the refillable lipsticks you buy them individually like this look how tiny it is it's so little and then you have to buy the container you just buy it once and then you can switch out the lipsticks and how you use it is you just pop it up like that and then you pull it out and then you can use it and this also comes off and you can swap out the colors so this is the color 08 major magnet I've been into browns lately. I just think they're so, so pretty and very wearable. And then I also got 01, the MVP, which is this really beautiful red. Oh, you guys, is that not stunning? Oh my, I need to wear that. Okay, so next let's move on to household items. So this is a carafe that I found at Target. I know you can see water spots on it. It is clean, I promise. It's just, those are dried water stains. So yeah, my husband and I uh, had been looking for a pitcher because I realized that we didn't have one, mainly for iced tea. We like to brew our own iced tea. So that's mainly what we've been using it for, but also iced coffee if you wanna make like a certain amount of iced coffee for the week and then just have it in the fridge ready to go. I mean, you can use this for anything, but it's just really, really pretty. It has the suction here, you can see, and then it has the two um, openings. So it has those little like dots there, and then it has the bigger opening there, depending on how much liquid you want out. And then you just kind of push it down and it stays down and then you can pour it out. It does say never to hold it from the lid. You always want to hold it from the actual craft. But yeah, I think it's just really nice, really practical. It doesn't take up too much room in your refrigerator. So love this. Okay, next bowls. I know this is so random, but I love bowls, you guys. I just, a really nice bowl can just, I don't know, can pull the space together. Is that just me? Can't just be me. Anyways, this bowl, look how pretty this is, right? This is, I love this. So actually, this is another social media uh, influenced purchase. So I first saw this bowl because I was watching a vlog from Kim Tai. So Kim got this bowl from Target and literally I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have it. So went to Target, found it. It's this huge bowl. I'm trying to show you, I guess, how big it is. Like this is my head and this is the bowl and I have a big head. <laughs> so yeah, the bowl, what is this made out of? It is, so it says stoneware. Yeah, it just says stoneware, um, hand wash only, food safe. Now she did say that this bowl was from, I can't remember, what she said it was from, but it's actually the Magnolia collection. So it's the Magnolia with Chip and Joanna Gaines, which I love them. So yeah, it's just a really nice, big, like centerpiece bowl. I wanna say in her vlog, she used it for fruit and that's what I would use it for as well. I mean, you could use this, it could be purely decorative or you could use it for food. I wanted it also for fruit. So like apples, oranges, and then avocados because we don't really have anywhere when we buy that produce, we just kind of like put it on the counter and sometimes they roll. I mean, it's just annoying. So I feel like this is perfect for, you know, fruit, but, but yeah, you can use this for anything. It's very heavy, really nice quality. If you're familiar with the Magnolia collection by Chip and Joanna Games, you know, like their stuff is really good. And I can't remember the price. Oh, here it is, $24.99. So I feel like for the quality, that's not bad. I love this though. Really, really good one. And then I have a second bowl. <laughs> I know this is kind of crazy, but have you guys, when you're watching TV, ever seen the Etsy commercials pop up? Like, I feel like they don't come up often, but every once in a while we'll be watching TV and then the Etsy commercial will just come up and they'll highlight certain shops. So this bowl, that's where I found this. I was watching TV. I was actually, I think I had paused it because I think my husband had 
run to the restroom. And so I paused it and it paused it on the Etsy commercial. And I was like, what is that gorgeous bowl? So this is from Element Clay Studio. And this is the large emerald green geode bowl or geode bowl. I'm probably saying that wrong, but look how pretty this is. And I'm hoping that the bright lights, I'm hoping you guys will be able to see but do you guys see the detail on this bowl? Like it goes all the way around. Of course it's handmade. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. And then the inside is like this porcelain emerald green. Um, on the commercial they were using it for salad. So that was like what I kind of had in mind too. I was like, oh, this is perfect. Like if you have a, a dinner party with friends or family and you have a big salad, you can just put it in here and it'll kind of like mix well because the green. But I mean, you can use this for anything. Again, decorative, food, whatever you want. But this is just so, so pretty. And it's not perfectly round, of course, because it is handmade. But I love that about it. It's like, I don't know, I'm just, it's, I feel like, I'm, I'm like, you know, you're getting old when bowls start to excite you. But this is so nice. So yeah, had to get this. If it is still being sold, I will definitely link it below. And I want to say she had a couple of colors too. So she had green and I think there was a really pretty turquoise one. So yeah. Check below, but this is so, so pretty. Okay, so we are nearing the end. We are on item nine. We're on item nine. And this is the brand Olivier Professional. So it comes with these two polishes, a pack of um, files, cuticle oil, the nail separator, and then some nail tools. So again, I'll link it below. But this is a magic remover. And I've never tried this before, but it's a magic remover for gel nails. And I'm not wearing it right now, but I usually do wear gel nail polish. So yeah, I guess you just, when you wanna get rid of your gel nail polish, you open this, you paint just on the gel. It does say on here, notice, please take care about your skin. Do not put in your body. And of course, keep out of reach of children. Um, so yeah, I haven't tried this yet. <laughs> But I'm really, really excited to give it a shot because if you are familiar with the gel nails, you know you have to like file it, then you have to soak it with acetone and it kind of takes a while, then you have to like pull it off. So this is supposed to, yeah, it says removes soak off gel polish. So you're supposed to be able to take off your gel polish in like a matter of like three to five minutes. So yeah, I'll let you guys know. I haven't actually tried this yet but I'll keep you posted. Okay, so we're down to the last product and I guess this is also kind of inspired by seeing influencers talk about it. But last year, I wanna say it was last year, I did a gift guide for Christmas and I talked about this. So this is the Louis Vuitton uh, key pouch, but it's just, it's super easy. You just put your keys on it. It was intended just to hold the keys so your keys don't like scratch the inside of your bag but a lot of people will use this as a wallet. And so I just thought it was really cute, really functional, you know, and so I, I have loved it. Um, I definitely use it, but I recently got this guy. I actually got this a while ago, but I kept it like this just so I could show you guys. <laughs> so we're going to unbox this and it is very similar. And it is the key holder, the six key holder, I wanna say. And so, yeah, as far as size go, as far as size goes, it's very similar in size. It's a little bit thicker, but what's nicer about it is you just kind of pop it open and you can put all of your keys there. So the one thing I will say about this guy is if you have, like if you don't have anything but keys and you just have a couple of keys on here, it's probably not that big of a deal. But I have um, this cross that I always carry and ironically next to the cross, I have a bottle opener. That's probably, I don't know, that's so great. But anyways, this is a bottle opener, which even more funny that I got from a DUI attorney. Anyways, so we have a bottle opener here and then I have a cross. Um, and so they're just kind of, I mean, they're not like super, super bulky, but sometimes when I stuff my keys in, it gets like jumbled. I don't know if that makes sense. And then you have to kind of like, you just have to kind of like play around with it. And so I was like, 
I kind of, I had been thinking about it for a while and I was like, I feel like this might be more convenient because instead of having to worry about the zip, all you have to do is like click it closed. So let me change it really fast just so I can show you guys, hold on. Okay, so I moved my keys from this guy to this guy. So just to show you, this is what it looks like in the six key holder. So I feel like it's just super easy and simple, especially with the button closure. The only thing I will say that you're losing with this is the ability to have it double as a wallet because this one, I feel like you can. You can definitely put your keys on here and then just leave it out. And then you can put like your ID, a credit card, even some cash and zip it up. So you don't have to worry about losing it. And this could, you could use this in lieu of a wallet. Whereas this one, there is an opening right here, but it goes straight through. So I'm not really sure why they gave that to you. I mean, I guess you could stuff some cards back there, but I mean, you just have to be aware that it could come out on the other side. So I don't know. But anyways, so that is everything. Those are all my recent finds. I know there's a lot of stuff all over the place, but yeah, I just wanted to share these things because I don't know. I think they're really good finds. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, again, I'll link everything below. But yeah, if you enjoy the video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.